So I figured uh, magicians like to make things float. And so I was going to bring a woman in here and, and make her float, and, uh, but uh, then I ran out of money. So we're going to try to make a paper clip float instead. All right, so here's some paper clips. All right, go ahead. Try to make a paper clip float. Just put it in the water and see if it floats. No, of course no. not. Now, there's a way on the website that I tell how to do this, but I actually got a new tip from an eight-year-old on how to make this trick work even faster. All right, take a paper clip yeah. and just kind of unfold it so it's kind of L-shaped like this. L-shaped, okay. All right. Then... Uh, just open up one of those. That, that's our little platform little there, okay. just like that. So it looks like this. Yeah. All right, get a paper clip yeah. and balance it on there. Like oh, a, yes. like a, I know, that's tricky. <laughs> there you go, you got it. Now you're going to slowly, slowly lower it into the water. And if all goes well, then scoot it out of the way. <gasps> Look at that. <laughs> Isn't that cool? And it's not really floating. It's actually surface tension that's holding it up. So it's, it's suspended. And you can just get those to float just like that. That is amazing. Isn't that cool? Now, Thanks. if you're in Japan, you know, because this is on the internet, so lots of people can see it, you get one of your Japanese yen. And these are made out of aluminum. And if all goes well, let's see if I can get this to work. Look at that. I can't believe it. Isn't that cool? <laughs> that is so cool. So, you know, cool. you just uh, have the kids come home from school and see if they can figure out how that works. And uh, by the way, a little touch of uh, soap on your finger in there, and phew, it won't work anymore. Really? All right, so that's another trick there. We made something float. And <laughs>